Hey, good morning. This is Mike Cousin here at the beachfront of South Florida, Lauderdale by the sea. And as you can see, we are on the beautiful cusp of the sun rising. Actually, it's been up for about an hour or so. But anyway, it's still a beautiful day. It's early morning. It's cool and crisp out here. It's probably about 50 degrees, maybe 52, something like that. I'm here with my dog, as you can see him. I don't know if he can or not, but we'll see on the video here that uh, he is just enjoying the waves coming in, and he's going, okay, I don't know what they're about, but I'm going to bark at them anyway. That's all good. Anyway, hope you're doing well. I just want to wish you guys a great holiday season, but you know what? More than anything, I wish you the best for 2011 coming up here. You know, for a lot of people, it's been a challenge. For a lot of people, it's been opportunity. And uh, it's the balance of life, and it's the ebbs and the flows. And as we see in the ocean here, coming in and coming out. But at the end of the day, it's really about um, how we react to them and how we deal with them on an ongoing basis and become better as a result, whether they're challenges or whether they're opportunities. And 2011 is no different, and it's going to be just another year. But it's a chance to um, to think about what you did over this past year. You know, we live in these calendars of switching over and changing our lives. But at the end of the day, really, it's a day day by day basis because you just don't know what it is. I don't think about the year to year. Yeah, it's a ton of celebration. We come through one year, went into another. It's a relaxation. It's a psychology. But at the end of the day, uh, it's like that every single day. Therefore, what do we have to think about on a daily basis is really what it's all about. You know, when is your new year going to begin? It's going to begin January 1st. Is it going to begin today? I like to think that it's going to begin today because at the end of our life, we don't celebrate the fact that we have a new year coming. We celebrate that we fact that we live life. And living life on a daily basis, living life from a power perspective of who you are, what you want in life is very important. And so when we deal with issues in life, we have to confront them in a very profound way on an emotional level. We have to live full out right now. No matter how bad the challenges are in your life, whatever you're facing, whatever devil in your life is facing you and pushing you towards something that's not going to give you encouragement or enthusiasm, Listen, my friends, break through now. Do you the best you can. It's not the end all. Trust me. We live in this world of personal and professional development, and we would imagine for a moment that the possibilities of folks like us who are motivational speakers or inspirational or coaches, whatever you want to call us, gurus. No, I want to be called a guru. I don't want to be called a motivational speaker. But at the end of the day, we have our ups and we have our downs. Our days have imperfections in them. But it's how we look at them that makes a difference. How you can look at your day that makes a difference. You know, somebody was talking to me the other day, and the conversation went as such that we have this idea about fantasy. We have this idea about living in this reality land. But what's the difference? Well, fantasy land is an area that we all strive for. Imagine for a moment Walt Disney not fantasizing about a world that we all can have an ideal world and live in. It's a company that's changed millions upon millions upon millions, if not billions of lives as a result of one man's dream that we can have that and have that experience and live in that. Imagine for a moment Somebody not fantasizing about the ability to watch me speak to you via this telephone right now that I'm talking to you on. I would be talking to you through a can and a piece of string. Imagine for a moment the guy or gal who was thinking about communicating with somebody and said, let's put a can and a piece of string together so we could talk to each other through energy and vibration. Imagine them never having that imagination. We wouldn't even have that. So, fantasize what it is that you want coming up in the days to come. Right today. Do it right now. What are you, what are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? Do something today that's going to take you to the next level of your life. All internal, emotionally, spiritually, financially, 
whatever it may be. And it's not going to be easy, but it is what it is. It's not going to be that hard either. It is what it is. So today, go out there and make it a great day. Enjoy life. Enjoy your new year coming up. Set some goals. Achieve them piece by piece. Don't get crazy if you don't hit your goals right away. But just know that they're out there for your taking. And you can have all you want in your life. Take care of other people. Say hello to those that you haven't said hello to in a long time. Give them a call. No need to apologize. Hey, just touching base, seeing how you're doing. Impact somebody every day and make that part of your life. Listen, have a great day. We'll talk to you soon. I'm going to leave you with a passionate movement towards the ocean with my king dog, Jocko, who is a mix between a high-tailed bull weevil and a man who chases white ebbs and flows of life in the waves. I hope you can see him here, but I hope to see you in the future. If you need anything, give us a holler, touch base. Have a great day.